Welcome to the Greatest Awakening of God, program number 62. My friend, I have the Harvest Christian Church with me over here with Minister Kekor Rosales. We're going to be praying, Lord, against all those Jezebels out there, spirits out there. We're going to pray in Jesus' name. Father, I loose the hounds of heaven against Jezebel. I rebuke and bind the spirits of witchcraft, lust, seduction, and adultery. Lord, I release the spirit of Jesus on top of them, Lord. I command Jezebel to be thrown down and eaten by the hounds of heaven. <laughs> I rebuke all spirits of false teaching, false prophecy, yes, adultery, Lord. perversion connected with Jezebel. Yes, Lord. I loose the tribulation against the kingdom of Jezebel. Oh, I cut Lord. off all the assignment of Jezebel against the cut minister off, of Jesus. God. I cut off and break the powers of every word released by Jezebel against my life yes. and those that are viewing, watching us. Father, I cut off Jezebel's table. I reject all food from it. And I cut off and I loose the mystery for all the curses of Jezebel and the spirits of Jezebel operating in my bloodline and the bloodline of everyone is tuning into this program. I cut off the assignment of Jezebel and her daughters to corrupt the church. Lord, I rebuke and cut off all the spirits attempted to destroy the royal seed. I come against the spirit of this evil spirits assigned to kill the prophets. I rebuke and cut off the spirit of the homemongers. I rebuke and cut off Jezebel and her witchcraft in the name of Jesus. I rebuke and I cut off all harlot, yes, harlots, Lord. mysteries of witchcraft, and I break the powers of disobedience in, in life, in my life, and my family life, and everyone who is tuned into this television show. I cut off the witchcraft in the hands and overcome Jezebel and receive the power over the nations in the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. And the blood of Jesus, we wash all that garbage Amen. away in Jesus' name. Welcome, the Greatest Awakening Harvest Church. How are you today, Minister? How are you? Lovely. I am good. Good. Today we're going to be talking <laughs> about we're going to be talking about pleasing God, my friend. That word, please God. We want to please God. The Bible says in Isaiah chapter forty-three, verse seven, it says, "Everyone who is called by my name." Whom I have created for my glory. I have formed him. Yes, I have made him. He's talking about the preachers like us who's talking to your television. Clearly says this. Everyone who is called by my name. Whom I have created. Not me. I never created myself. God created me. Over here it says. I have formed him. Yes, I have made him. This people I have formed. For myself. My friend, God has created us for Himself to give the news, to be the messenger, to be the teachers, to be the ministers of God. Amen. The uncompromiser. We're not here to please men. We are here to please God. We're God pleasers, not man pleasers. My friend, if you're a man pleaser, you're in trouble. The people I have formed <laughs> for myself, they shall declare. My praise. What's so funny? Uh, God pleasers, devil teasers. <laughs> God pleasers and devil teasers. Devil can't have me, bro. Devil cannot have you. No, you you ever heard the song? You can't touch this. <laughs> you can't touch this. Devil can't have me. Cannot. Negative. The Bible says You're in out. John chapter 4, verse 23. What does the word of God says? It says, but the hour is coming, and now is when the true worshipers will worship the Father in spirit, spirit and in and truth. truth. For the Father is seeking such worship. Oh, boy. Him. The Father, our Father, are searching for such worshipers. Amen. Not gossipers. Worshipers. Say it. Worshipers. 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 Not worshipers. Not wi <laughs> worshipers. Yeah. No, no, no. Not worshipers. Worshipers. Or we, whispers. We know whisper and no we, whisper Jesus. Exactly. For the Father is seeking such worship. That's in John 4, 23, 24. John chapter 4, verse 23 and verse 24. Okay? God is spirit and those who worship him. My friend, there is no other way. There is no compromising. You must worship him in spirit. And in truth. And in truth, my friend. Indeed, I came to pass... When the trumpeters, when the trumpeters and singers were 
as one to make one sound to be heard of praising and thanking the Lord. And when they lifted up their voice with the trumpets and the cymbals of instruments of music, and they praised the Lord, saying, For He is good. Thank you, Jesus. For God is good. And you're supposed to say all the time, God is good. Every time. And every time. In the night. In the in day. The night, in the day. In the, in the shade. Evening, in the sun. In your mess. In your humbleness. In your troubleness. God in your is tribulation. good. In your tribulation. Pitch fuck moments. God is good. Even in this perverted nation. <laughs> yeah. For, for his mercy endures forever. forever. My friend, God feels sorry for you. He's looking down at you. Oh, that poor thing. Poor, poor people, poor thing. Ready for the fire. Let me grab them by the ears and bring them out of the fire. <laughs> <laughs> That's God, yeah? Yeah. If you got to grab me, Lord, if you want to grab me out of my, by my ears and bring me out, so be it. Grab me by my arms, please. <laughs> Sometimes you got to be the ears. You know why? The arms don't work. So if he pulled the arm this way, we will jump right back in. He pulled the arm and think, bro. <laughs> oh. Obi says that the house of the house, the house, that the house, the house of the Lord was filled with a cloud so that the priest could not continue ministering because of the cloud. Wow! So that the priest could not continue ministering. The cloud came in so deep into the presence of the house of the Lord, my friend. Yes. You couldn't even see the minister. You couldn't even see the high priest. It was covered up with clouds. And then the priest became silent because... The glory of the Lord would fill the house. You understand? And that's in 2 Chronicles chapter 5, verse 13, verse 14, my friend. You also are as living stones. Wow, you also as living stones. You are being built up spiritual house, a holy priesthood to the offering of spiritual sacrifice acceptable to God through Jesus Christ. It doesn't say through Virgin Mary. It doesn't say through the stupid clay statue. Grab them and slam them on the ground and throw them in the trash can because that's garbage. You understand? All those beads and the cross hanging down, throw rosary, <laughs> throw it in the trash can. Rubbish. But you are a chosen uh, generation. Let's elaborate on them. Tell them why it's rubbish first. Okay, why it's rubbish? Because in Matthew 6. My friend, re cl read clearly. God created you, right? So God is the creator, right? Did man create you? No. Okay, so why do you play with the things that man made and worship it? Isn't it that stupid? Let me elaborate. Why do you want to worship a tree that the man went carve to, like, to look like an idol? It's kind of stupid when God himself made the, key, the trees. Who do you think made the trees? Huh? Pele. Okay. Negative. In Matthew 6, this is why, from Scripture, why you shouldn't. Why? Go ahead. Why? <laughs> it says in Matthew 6, Jesus is speaking. He says, Take heed that ye do not your alms before men to be seen of them. Otherwise, ye have no reward of your Father which is in heaven. Okay, wait. Let's move on to, uh, deeper into it. And it says, When you pray, Thou shalt not be as one of the hypocrites Hypocrites are, for they love to pray, standing in the synagogues, in the corners of the streets, that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their word. But when thou prayest, enter in thy closet, and we shut thy door, and pray to thy Father which is in secret. And thy Father which seeth in secret shall reward them openly. But when ye pray, do not use vain repetitions as the heathen do, for they think that they shall not shall be heard for their much speaking. So vain repetitions. I mean, you can't be repeating, Our Father what in heaven. Our Father what in heaven. Our Father what in heaven. He's not, he's not, he knows what you need of. Like they tell the Catholics, say eight Hail Marys. That, that, that's why you say, that, eight Hail Marys. That's why, that's why the, the rosary that you're talking about, they keep going on with the beads and they keep going, I don't know why, I don't know. I guess it's Romans who made that because Romans didn't like Anyway, yeah, but Jesus. the borders get the beats too, you know. They squeeze them. Oh. Okay, that, that's good for them. But I'm letting you guys know. <laughs> they don't even know what, they, what they're saying. Wow. What is that? <laughs> Used to have this baller head man on TV. And all he do is go like this. Look at TV. Look like this. <laughs> He's on the swing, baller head. Right in the swing. That's all he does. 
I call him up. I said, hello, is this? <laughs> he goes, yes, what can I do for you? I said, do you believe that that garbage noise you're making on television to irritate us is power, is from God? He said, yes, my son. That's the power of God. I said, oh, and you're telling me that power can do anything? He said, yes, all you're going to do is go. <laughs> I said, okay, then let me ask you a question. Why are you still bald-headed? All that noise you was making on the swing. <laughs> How come your hair never grow? After I told him that, my friend, guess what? He's never on television again. He gave it up. You know why? Because <laughs> the truth shall set you free. Get a hairpiece and shut the hell up. What? Go ahead. Wow. Did it keep going with that? Woo! Oh, it was so irritating. And it was on, 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 on television 42, uh, 49, Woo! 52, and 53. And I was watching this garbage and I was getting irritated. Woo! <laughs> yeah, ball headed. Right in the swing outside with the birds in the background. Maybe he liked Michael, Michael Jackson. But just like holding the note. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a flat tire. Yeah. <laughs> so what I'm saying, my friend, is I don't want you walking deceptively or in deception. Throw away that rosary. You're not supposed to pray them over and over again. And besides, I look for Hail Mary in the Bible. I was Catholic before. <laughs> I cannot find Hail Mary. And besides, why should I hail to Mary? She never did nothing. All she did was pull out Jesus. She was lucky. She said, oh, She's I'm blessed. blessed to be chosen by, by the Father. I'm blessed. He has chosen me. Uh -huh. But isn't it true that Mary clearly said, she never said, hey, bow down, kiss my toes. <laughs> isn't it true that Mary said, worship me. They get she it. said, bow down, kiss his Mary toes. Mary <laughs> said, my Lord. My Savior. My Savior. Jesus. Jesus. You know what? She never called him son. Did you know that? Did you know that Jesus never called her mother? What did Jesus call Mary, who was his mother? He said, woman. 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 He never go, mother, mother, can I have some milk? Negative. Okay, continue. Okay, keep going. My friend, indeed, it come to pass but Ovia says clearly, you are also living stones. We are living stones. It doesn't say stay stone or be stoned. 15 minutes left. Being <laughs> built upon the spiritual house of the holy priesthood to offer spiritual sacrifice. Acceptable. My friend, you want to be acceptable. Or do you want to be like the story of the two brothers where Cain and Abel? I want to be Abel. You can be Cain. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> No, I mean, okay. <laughs> only Cain. Only Cain, the Cain. Yeah, I only got on Cain for what? No, I, I rebuke that. You okay, don't want Cain. <laughs> All right. Break the Cain. Throw him in the trash can. I take sugar Cain. I walk in in Jesus' name. Break the Cain and throw him in the trash can. You don't need oh, a, You don't sugar. need no Cain. <laughs> you are my <laughs> What? Oh, no. I bind through God, you. <laughs> through Jesus Christ. <laughs> through God, through Jesus Christ. Not on Jesus' shows. Come on. Yes. But you are chosen generation of royal priesthood, holy nation. His own special people. My friend, you are special people when you're in the heirs of the Most High God, when you're on His side. Amen. Over he says, you are proclaimed as priests of Him. I am a priest of Jesus. He is a priest of Jesus. So is the, fa the, the, the fathers at home who's watching this program. But if you you are to be the priest, <laughs> not the priestess. Hello. Give back your panty. <laughs> and then I take back the pants. That's more better than the mumu. That's more better than the mumu. Give them back the panty. Give them back the panty. Put back your your babies and put back on your your pants. Why? You're a priest. You're not a priestess. Say again. You're a priest, not a priestess. Amen. I'm a priest, not a priestess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you are proclaimed to praise of Him who is called out of darkness. Into marvelous light. Light, my friend, light. Not bad light. Not middle light. Not the wrong light. The true light. The real light. Everlasting light. The fathers of light. Jesus, the light of all lights. The great and morning light. Oh, the day sun. 
the everlasting light, the everlasting peace. My friend, when you're going to meet him, you shall see the light, the bright light. If not, the fire. then you got the fire light that's the wrong kind. My everlasting friend, fire. Down, my friend said, oh, I had a vision. I saw them going through the fire to go to heaven. I said, my friend, that ain't no heaven. That's hell. If you got to go through the fire to go to heaven, my friend, you in hell. Period. You understand? Much of the guys in the Bible who didn't get burned by the fire. Except those was in a fire. That's on earth though, see? That That's was on earth, you see? Jesus was, was walking. Him. And just look at you the fire. They say, hey. I see four. I don't see three. I see four. Jesus was in there with them. And you know what? I, I want to worship your God. I want to worship him now. Because you guys didn't get burned. Exactly. But you are a chosen generation, royal priesthood by the holy nation. His special people. Proclaim the praises of him called your darkness unto marvelous light. Therefore, let him continually offer the sacrifice of praise to God. That is the fruit of our lips. Giving thanks to him. My friend, you can thank God. You go, but I don't have nothing to go to church to give God. Hey, you can give him your thanks from your lips. And let it come from your heart. Because whatever comes from the mouth comes from the heart. Yeah, but you got to worship in spirit and in truth. Huh? Can it be... Hallelujah. <laughs> I love the singing. <laughs> no, my friend. Hey, look down at you. Who are you worshiping? You're looking around everybody, not at me. You're not even thinking of me. Who are you thinking about? Oh, your car. Oh, what time is it, Paul? I better go to the bathroom. They're worshiping now. Wow. Flat tire. <laughs> my friend, but do not forget to do good to share for with such sacrifice. Hey, God is well pleased, my friend. He's so well pleased when you stand before him one day, he's going to say, Welcome, my good and faithful servant. Enter into the house of the Lord. Not even well done. Welcome. <laughs> yes, not well done. Like they're in the eternal state, all black and burn. Turn or burn. Welcome. And welcome and well done. <laughs> <laughs> the Bible says in Revelation chapter 4, verse 11, You are worthy, O Lord, to receiving glory and honor and power. For you created all things. And by you will they exist, and they were created. You can read this one if you want. Hebrews. Uh, keep going on. Okay. Colossians chapter 1, verse 10. That you may walk worthy of the Lord, fully pleasing Him, being fruitful in good work, and increasing the knowledge of God. My friend, the Bible says in the end times, in the last days, knowledge shall increase. My friend... Look at your television and witness the evidence of the scripture. And they go, knowledge is power. Knowledge is power. Though. But the world knowledge yeah. is garbage. That's the, but the knowledge of God's knowledge and power is unlimited. Oh, God's wisdom, not the world's wisdom. Exactly. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, in Romans 12, 1, by the mercies of God that you present your bodies as a living sacrifice, Holy as acceptable to God, which is your reasonable service. My friend, you see this body I have on? I need to use it not only on the bed, all you know, with uh, Father Mattress and Saint Pillow all day. I worship you, Almighty God, and no one like you. It's Negative. Good. If you sleep with that, that'd be good though. But just don't sleep oversleep, huh? Yeah, like sleep all day, all night. You know what I mean? Yeah. And you wake up, you're getting bigger and bigger, and you don't fit in the clothes. Then you can't even walk through the door. Then you can't walk through the door. You got to turn sideways. <laughs> <laughs> you turn sideways. So when they go back, what do they do? They bend, bend through the windows. Uh, <laughs> or they drill the floor. That's when the fireman going to come and break your walls. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my friend. It may sound funny, but to so, tell you the truth, happened. it really happened. The fire department had to cut the walls down and bring the person out to take them to the hospital with a huge size bed and deliver them on a truck. It's not, you know, it's funny, but it's a fact. Do become those, you know, overdoing it. You know what I mean, my friend? If you go sleep, sleep eight hours is good for you. Five is better. No, no, no. Five would be way greater, but sometimes 15. You'd be tired. <laughs> if you're real tired like me, go 15. But that's if you're up for two days straight. How about three days straight? Like 24? 24 hours. <laughs> yeah. You just get so busy with the Lord. You're excited. My friend, excited. I'll pass it on to you. What do you want to oh, say? Oh, just keep going. Keep going. No, no, keep going. Oh, we're having so much fun here. <laughs> okay. It's always fun to talk about Jesus. Yeah, it says, Therefore, I exalt first 
of all supplications, prayers, and intercessions, and giving thanks be made for all men. For this is good and acceptable in the sight of God our Savior. I desire therefore that men pray everywhere, lifting up holy hands without, doubt. without the wrath of doubting. My mouth shall speak the praises of the Lord, and all my flesh shall bless His holy name forever and ever. Psalms 145, 21. Oh, clap your hands, all you people. Shout to God with your voices. Glory! Glory! Woo! Hallelujah! Yeah. Hey, my friend, if you're in church, and they, and they start telling you, shh, 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 run! Shh, shh. And they don't like you praising the Lord loud. Woo! Glory! Glory, Jesus! I love you! If they tell you, shh, shh, shh. Hey, hey, come here. You're too loud. And, and if you sit in a church, my friend, go like this with your hand. Go like this. Sit back and observe that preacher. And get a little notepad next to your hand. From that one hour sermon or two hours, all you need to do is write down how many times did that pastor, I don't care if it's a male or female pastor, has mentioned Jesus. If, if that person didn't even mention Jesus once, or even twice, or even three times, or even four times, get out of there. What if maximum's two times? Maximum two times, still get out of there. That's bad. Get out. Who are you worshiping? Get out. Who are you guys worshiping? Exactly, my God. friend. Oh, God. 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 God said this. God wants you. God loves. Oh, God wants you to be rich. God wants you to be a billionaire. That's right, you. God wants you to have brand new eyelashes. And that God, God wants, wants you to have brand new perfume. <laughs> he wants you to own the factory. He wants you with thousands of pairs of shoes. And that God wants you in the God fire. God wants you into what? <laughs> that God wants you in the fire. That's called God of the world. That's right. You heard what he said? That's the God that wants you in the fire, my friend. For five minutes left, we're going to tell you. Yeah. That that's the God who wants you in the flame burning into everlasting The father of screaming. lies. The devil. The father of lies. They're not the children of God. Jesus even said, for there are the children of the devil. My friend, the Bible says in the last days, false prophets, these people, they should come in wolves, in sheep's clothing, smelling holy, looking holy. If I got to walk down Winter Mall, or any mall that I walk down, my friend, with a big giant cross, and wear those big, all black, like the priest wearing this white thing around the neck, to expose that I am a minister. I am Reverend Ray. I'm a minister. The name tag says, the greatest preacher, harvest, Christian, minister. My friend, that's all flat tire. Dear Reverend, baby, revved up. <laughs> yeah. My friend, I should be dressed locally like how you see my shirt on TV. You'll see me in the mall wearing these shirts or maybe even close to these shirts, locally, like anyone else, I can blend in and walk in the mall. You should be able to pick me out who is the real Christians. By your fruits. By the fruits, meaning love, love peace, peace, humbleness, joy, joy, long-suffering, self-control, self-control, not, I hate you. Patience. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> go to heaven. No, no, yeah, no. go to heaven. <laughs> My friend, it's time to be lovable. It's time to be real. Release the power of the living God. Release the love that God has <laughs> given to you. <laughs> oh, eh, no, no, huh? Not the power, the, the first not one. Not this power, the one. Eh. Oh, 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 my ears. Ah. Irritating. Would you want to watch me on TV going like this all day? Oh, 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 oh. Call cardiac patient the mental hospital and see if the patient will escape. <laughs> you understand? My friend, you can be mental, but you don't have to stay mental. You can be mentally in love with God. I love Jesus. Oh, not the singing, but Jesus. Not the singing, but the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. My friend, Jesus you can Christ be is happy. Lord. You can be happy with Jesus. Oh, woo. oh, I love Jesus. I got the joy, 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 the joy, joy of the joy, Lord. Joy, joy of the Lord. But if I'm in the mall holding this Bible like this, walking down the mall, showing off like this, then I'm just a hypocrite. You understand? Hypocrite. Like Jesus said, don't go out in the street where everybody can hear you preaching real loud. 
Jesus. Or you're going to the hospital and rebuking them in the hospital, the demons. Come out, devil. I bind you. You don't do that in the hospital. You're going to give the patients heart attack. And then they're going to die. And then what you're going to do? Run out of the hospital. Unless you can resurrect them from the dead, then you can go do that. But if you're a phony and you're a fake and you're a bragger, you're out. Do you understand? I understand. Do you understand? I understand. Do you, do you understand? <laughs> Ask them, do they understand? Do you understand? <laughs> My friend, at the Greatest Awakening and the Harvest Christian Church here, we have one minute left. We love you, my friend. Send in your prayer requests. I'm going to make sure that your prayer requests will get heard. My friend, our prayers go right through the ceiling, past the ceiling fan, because if it doesn't pass the ceiling fan, oh, they Lord. got all caught up and it fell down. Oh, Ours, Lord. we shoot right through the ceiling fan, right into the throne, the presence of God. Why? Because we've got angels can be depended on that's going to hand deliver the message. My friend, God loves you at the Greatest Awakening and the Harvest Christian Church that will be on Channel 4952 very soon in your neighborhood on your television set. Thank you for joining us. Aloha, ahui ho, malamapono. Amen. In Jesus' name.